The Indiana Utility Re Regulatory Commission is investigating the impact of COVID-19 on energy companies and customers. Some of the largest utility providers in the state, including Vectron, requested a look at their losses two weeks ago. The IURC will consider whether to allow power shutoffs and rate increases, which could mean you would pay more. Eyewitness News' Kayla Sullivan reports from our Indiana State House newsroom. For some Hoosiers, whether they will have power in a couple of months is up to the Indiana Utility Regulatory Commission. Right now, the shutoff moratorium ends June 30th. I'm not sure that those hard dates are realistic, and certainly not for people who can't pay the power bill right now. Duke Energy customer Rick Mummy isn't in that boat, but he is concerned about those who are. I don't think anybody wants people to have to go without power, which also causes them to lose their housing. Um, so I don't think we want to put people on the streets right now. He's urging the IURC to extend the power shutoff ban and be fair when it comes to accepting any kind of rate increase. I wouldn't like it. I don't like any of my bills to go up. But he would be willing to accept it if companies could truly prove the need. As long as it's not entirely rigged in their favor. The Citizens Action Coalition doesn't think there is a need for one right now. Executive Director Kerwin Olson says he would have liked for the IURC to deny it right away. But instead... They've allowed the utilities to sort of make their case, which means those of us who oppose that have to also sort of make a case and present present evidence. So it's, a, it's burdensome on the public, and nobody has time for this right now. Aside from debt caused by people who can't pay for energy right now, utilities claim they've seen an increase in labor costs due to COVID-19. Companies are also looking to recover expenses like cleaning supplies and personal protection equipment. Not saying utility companies should not be allowed to recover certain expenses, incremental expenses that they've incurred as a result of the pandemic, but lost revenues uh, as a result of, of, of the pandemic uh, is a bridge too far. Mummy says whatever happens, he hopes the decision is just. Well, balance is necessary. From the Indiana State House newsroom, Kayla Sullivan, Eyewitness News. Now, thousands of people have written the IURC letters against rate increases. The commission will make a decision on whether to extend the power shutoff ban before June 30th.